Obama has a dream, a dream from his father, that the sins of colonialism be set right and America be downsized. That is a scene from 2016, Obama's America. It is, by the way, the second highest grossing political documentary of all time. And now its conservative filmmaker, Dinesh D'Souza, has been indicted on charges that he violated federal campaign laws. Dinesh's co-producer of the film is fighting back, saying this is selective prosecution. For that now, that producer joins us right now from Oklahoma City. He has, by the way, produced movies like Schindler's List and Rain Man. He is Gerald Mullen. Gerald, good morning to you. Good morning, Steve. You know, uh, what's going on with your friend Dinesh? It looks like the government's coming after him because he made a movie that was critical of President Obama. Yeah, it's amazing, isn't it? Uh, you uh, get involved in telling the truth about something and, uh, and they have a, a tendency to come after you. Well, the reason the reason I say it, it looks like, he, you know, he made the uh, 2016, you guys made 2016 and now they're after him is because back in the day, uh, John Edwards, who was running for president, had a campaign donor who did exactly the same thing. And he wound up with a misdemeanor, whereas Dinesh uh, had has a big bail and faces years in prison. Right. It's just not right. Well, what do you think is going on? Well, I think uh, personally, I think that there's uh, uh, the selective uh, persecution in this case. Is, it's uh, just the government going after someone that they feel is, is either against them or maybe just the fact that they're, he's not for them. Do you think the government is trying to intimidate him? Well, I think so. I think that might be part of it. We have another film coming out in, on July 4th, uh, the film America, and uh, maybe they're af afraid of what the content of that film is. Well, we don't have the whole movie, but we do have a trailer from America the movie that comes out on the 4th of July. Here's a snippet. Right. The defining feature of American history, we stole the country from the Indians, it was their land, and the white man took it by force. We stole the labor of the African Americans to build the country, at least the South. We stole half of Mexico in the Mexican War that American foreign policy today is based on plunder. Well, that, that's quite an assessment that uh, America is based on stealing things and plunder. Right, but I think the, the film basically takes that issue head on. And uh, in fact, I think I'm quoting Dinesh uh, regarding that. And uh, it's going to be an eye opener. I, I think people should, should uh, certainly plan on going to the theater on July 4th. All right. Well, that's when it opens. Uh, Gerald Molin, co-producer of 2016 and America as well. Thank you very much for joining us today from Oklahoma City. Thanks for having me, Steve. You bet.